Hey, what's going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is Darrell. We are here with some NBA 2K Mobile. We are back with some news. This time around, we got the first theme of Season 6. Y'all saw the video over the weekend. We revealed all the cards that will be featured in this theme. But this time, we're going to talk about the power requirements. Based on the official announcement, says early look at first theme of Season 6, Record Breakers. The first event is going to be Overtime. The top reward is going to be a Garnett Bill Russell. The second reward will be a Cobalt LeBron James, which is going to be an incredible card. You can see his power is already 276k. Then the first reward is going to be a Zircon Irvin Hayes, who's coming in at 250k. The second reward is going to be King of the Court, where the final reward will be a Garnett Kobe Bryant. He's coming in at 299.4k. And Bill Russell is slightly higher than him. So you can see these cards are pushing 300 k already. Second reward will be a Cobalt Patrick Ewing, Knicks Nation, you already know. And then the first reward will be a Zircon Derek Fisher, which I'll show you images of those players so you can get an idea what their power is as well. Now, there is a change to the overtime event, and I think this is a really good one in my opinion. It will be unique with Bill Russell being available being the progression and the hardcore leaderboard. So for those of you that don't want to grind progression rewards, which is basically the format for every other event, you can still grind the hardcore leaderboard and go for the hardcore win streak. Now, the power requirements for each tier before the event starts, in order to get Zircon rewards, you have to have 200k power. In order to get the Cobalt rewards, you got to have 260k power. And in order to get the Garnet rewards, you need to be at 280k power. Now, a lot of people are saying, how are you going to reach 280k power? So I am currently working on that right now. And I'm going to tell you, it is very possible as long as you have a Chaos Diamond squad. But what's most important is you want to be able to add on mentors. So if you do have a previous version of a player that has pretty decent power, it would make sense to turn them into a mentor because they do get a bonus for using the same team. We did that with Stephen Curry. We did it with Kobe. And you see, we just did a Jade mentor for Larry Bird. We did a Cosmo Jasper for Willis Reed. I was able to get a Julius Randle mentor to use it. And then for Shaquille O'Neal, we used a Pearl Shaq for the beginning of the season, which I think was historic greats. So it's very possible as long as you go about doing it that way. And as of right now, only three of the players are at max three star. So you don't even really need to max them out all the way. We got Stephen Curry out of two star. So I'm going to turn him into a three very soon. And then Willis Reed is still a one star. Not even trained up all the way. I do have another Willis Reed too that I can merge into this one. So it's going to be very possible to hit 280k. And for those of you that are free to play, it's still possible as well. Because I do have my second account that i don't really play a lot but i did go back to it recently and that account just hit chaos diamonds here you're still going to be able to hit garnet fairly quick because if you look at the power of the rewards so let's say right now you're probably like in zircon the first reward is 250k without being upgraded or trained so i'm sure if you get that up to like a one or two star it's still going to be pretty decent power which will help you get up to that garnet level probably for the king of the court event but i still think it's possible to hit it before season six starts now, in other news, now some people have also been asking me if Wemby is going to be available for players to obtain fairly easy. The answer is yes. And this card is actually free, right? You don't have to grind any events to get them. You just got to log into the game seven days. And you'll be able to get a Pearl Wemby on your squad. So that's a pretty massive W, especially for new players coming into the game. All right, so there you have it. I'm excited for Season 6, and trust me, we got more content lined up. So stay tuned in and subscribe for more NBA 2K Mobile. As always, I catch everyone in the next one. Peace out.